Have you ever shot a video, loaded it in Final Cut, then realized you look like an alien because the color of your skin tone is so off? Well, I got a quick fix for you, and it just takes a few steps. Welcome back to the channel. My name's Shai. Let's jump right in. All right, so looking at my image here, the reason my face looks orange is because I was shooting so many different things for the day, and when I went back to shoot myself, my light was on 3200 Kelvin, and it was just too warm. And other reasons might be there's different things in the room that are reflecting a certain color on your face. And so you want to be able to correct that. So it's really quick. Let me show you how to do that. You're going to go to view here, hit show in viewer and go to video scopes. You can also use the shortcut command seven. So go to video scopes and hit this little box here. And we want to go to vector scope. And you want to go back in there again and hit show skin tone indicator. So see that line that just appeared right here? We wanna make sure that our color is right in the middle of this line. But we only wanna make sure we expose for our skin tone on the face here. So we're gonna go down here and hit crop. I'm gonna minimize this a little bit. And I wanna crop in right at my face right there and I'm going to go back and enlarge this and if you look see how it's right off of the line we want this right in the middle so to get there we're going to go to color and then we're going to hit hue saturation curves now it's really easy we want to just go to hue versus hue and we're going to move this down and up until I'm going to go up actually to see right there. It's hitting the middle part now. Now I'm still a little bit orange. So now I'm going to go scroll all the way down and hit orange versus sat and also push this down. Now, of course, move it to your liking. I think right about here looks good for my skin tone, maybe a little lower. And then I'm going to hit done and then go back to the film strip, uncheck crop. Perfect. So now I'm going to toggle off of hue saturation. There's your before really orange and now close to my natural skin tone. Hopefully after today, you don't ever have to worry about bad skin tones. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe so hopefully I can share some more tips on Final Cut, Photoshop, and Lightroom. I'll see you on the next video.